Good morning, good day, and good afternoon. Uh, today, I'm going to show you a tutorial on uh, how can you use the front and rear 3.5 millimeter jacks uh, at the same time to switch between your headphones and your speakers without unplugging them. First, I'm going to show you the software I'm using for that and it's going to be located in your uh, tray under Realtek HD Audio Manager. Now, when you have both your headphones and uh, speakers plugged into your computer in front and rear panel, when you open this, you can use this option here under analog front, just click on it, and it gives you the option to decide which device is plugged in. Currently, I have my front speaker app set as the main. So my speakers are going to be working. I can instantly switch to headphones, press OK. And now it is my headphones and headphones only that are going to be working. So to get this uh, HD audio manager working, you'll have to navigate to uh, ROG uh, download section. The link's going to be in the description. You click on ROG drivers and then instead of entering a model name uh, you select a product scroll down to commercial and uh, motherboard then you select the product series which is going to be ATX motherboards and then you select the product model I select a B360 plus I do not own this video uh, this motherboard but it seems to be working on both of my systems so I'm going with this one after you got that open Click on driver utility and uh, then please select OS Windows 10 64 bit if you have 32 bit or others choose that but I'm going with Windows 10 64 bit scroll down to audio and here we go audio uh, and just click download on it it's gonna take a minute a couple of minutes depending on your internet speed so wait for it to be downloaded <clears throat> okay I'll fast forward it I've cut to the point where it's downloaded so now you simply open it up and extract it to your desktop or you can just launch the setup exe let's go ahead and select all Extract to. I'm gonna put it down to desktop under um, any file name you want. GV2 and let it extract. Now that that is done, go ahead, navigate to your folder, open it up and scroll down to setup exe. I have it already set up but for the sake of demonstration I'm gonna go through the whole setting up process again. So uh, first you're gonna have to uninstall all the existing Realtek drivers if you do have any. Just navigate next, press next, allow the uh, install installer to delete all the necessary files and then you're gonna have to restart your computer after the restart, uh, the setup is going to start up automatically again. Install all the necessary files and you're going to be good to go. So I'm going to fast forward this one. And press yes, I want to restart my computer now. And press finish and restart your device. Now I'm going to go through a quick restart. Be right back. After a fresh restart, I had to re install the software for the third time simply because after a restart I forgot to close down my OBS <laughs> so there we go it started up the installation after it deleted all the files uh, for the audio driver so just press next and uh, let it finish up finalize the installation and you should have the Realtek HD audio manager in there as well so I'm just going to cut to the end of installation. 
No, thank you. I am too poor for this. Okay, and now you just have to press finish. Uh, N's going to restart your computer again. I'm going to stop my recording because if I press finish, the video file is going to get corrupted again. So I'll see you after the restart. Uh, let's check the tray, and there we go. Realtek HD Audio Manager. Just double click it, and uh, all the settings you need. Uh, so make sure your amplification level is going to be set to extreme by default. Set it to performance, just in case not to damage uh, your speakers or your headphones when you're listening to music loudly. And here you go. Here you have the setting. Just click on your uh, analog input and select which device is currently going to be active. So for the sake of demonstration, let's take the front speakers, press OK, switches the devices, and uh, let's turn, turn on a song, and I hope you can hear it in my microphone. And you know how we do. That's okay. And now let's do the same thing. Let's switch it up and uh, put it to headphones. Press OK. Switch to headphones. I'm going to put my headphones to the microphone just for the sake of demonstration and play. And there we go. It works on. And there we go. It works on both my headphones, which is plugged in to the 3.5 mil jack in the front of the case. And it works on my speakers, which is plugged in at the back of the case. Whew, that took some time. So I hope this helped you. And uh, if you don't mind, please uh, drop me a like and a subscribe. Uh, I'm trying to get this thing started. So let's see how it goes. Uh, thanks for your time and thanks for watching. I hope you have a nice day. Ta.